a 1.2 kilogram block is at rest on a frictionless surface. Then a 10 gram bullet traveling at 300 meters per second penetrates the block and emerges with the a speed of uh, 80 meters per second. Find the speed of the block immediately after the bullet emerges. This is a collision problem. During collision, the forces between the bullet and the block are equal and opposite action force and reaction force pair. So the net force on the whole system is zero. This means that we have the conservation of momentum. So initially, the bullet is the one with the momentum. The block has no momentum. Over here, the bullet's mass is giving us 10 grams. So we need to convert the 10 grams to kilograms. Now, 1,000 grams is uh, one kilogram. So to change 10 grams to kilograms, we just have to divide it by a thousand. Divided by a thousand, we get 0 0.01 kilograms. So the mass of the bullet is 0 0.01 kilograms and the velocity is uh, 300. Afterwards, both the block and the bullet have momentum. The block has a mass of 1.2, the velocity Vf, the bullet has a mass of 0.01 and the velocity of 80. So from this equation, we can solve for the final velocity of the block, which is 1.83 meters per second. We get this velocity is a positive number, which is the same sign as the 300. So it must be in the same direction to the right. In this process, the bullet slows down and loses momentum. The bullet's lost momentum is passed to the block through the collision. 